Mom. Dad. I'm pregnant. You think she said it like that? Almost like, here it is. Deal with it. And by the way, your grandson, he'll be the son of the most high God. <laughs> yeah, how, how do you even say that? The angel told her not to be afraid. And Mary, well, we know she was faithful. So maybe, maybe she just decided to believe him. That whatever was about to happen, she was gonna be okay. When do you think she realized that she hadn't accidentally found herself in this situation, but she'd actually been chosen for it? Because when you know that you're chosen, that's when you know that you're loved. And when you're loved, well, that gives you the kind of confidence you need to walk through doors everyone else wouldn't dare go through. But Mary dared. She dared to trust God as she watched him give life, then give it up for our sakes. And it all, in the unforgettable miracles and the very scary moments, she trusted his will rather than demanded answers, walked forward instead of turned back, stepped out instead of hit. Kind of makes you want to be like that little girl, huh? So do not be afraid. Listen carefully, for I proclaim to you good news that brings great joy to all the people. Today, your Savior is born in the city of David. He is Christ the Lord. This will be a sign to you. You will find a baby wrapped in strips of cloth and lying in a manger. Glory to God in the highest and peace on earth to men on whom his favor rests.